Organizers and Easel are absolutely delighted to have this HCC summit here in Geneva. The combination of basic science and clinical science in one meeting is just fantastic. Uh, overall, in the West and in the developing world, uh, where viral hepatitis is endemic, liver cancer is uh, growing in its incidence. To my mind, the most important unmet need is that we have limited drugs available in advanced cancer. So far, uh, we cannot heal HCC patients. So basically the incidence equals mortality in HCC. And so we need better drugs, we need better targets, and we need more successful trials than we have seen in the past. Now we know that there is not only one type of liver cancer, but there is a huge number of type of liver cancer. Each tumor is like a unique case and with the accumulation of genetic and epigenetic alteration. There are some new evidence from basic research showing that we may better certify patients for a specific treatment system in targeted therapies. And we also know from clinical research that we may translate that soon, I think, for the care of these patients. I'm hoping to see what are new frontiers of HCC investigations. ISO Summit is uh, always very interesting and I hope that uh, we, I mean all investigators, uh, all researchers um, will leave the meeting with more information about the possibility um, metabolomics, um, genomics uh, and also clinical way to, to predict hepatocellular carcinoma. It's just the right size of, an, of a meeting to cover this topic. It's very interactive. I think that the summit has been very successful and I will describe it as um, intense and with so far very high scientific level. EASL is dedicated to provide uh, uh, the superb platform for exchange in liver disease and also the best educational programs you can get in liver disease. There are tons of information on the internet which has been validated by EASL members that you can have access to. This HCC summit was an excellent experience for everybody because in the same place and in the same period of time we had the very best physicians dealing with the carcinoma and the very best scientists dealing with this disease.